Hi and welcome to How To with Dave from Divi Engine. In this video I want to show you how to add your website onto the Google Search Console, an incredibly powerful online tool to make your website work for you to get clicks, impressions, money. So I'm going to show you how to do that and then in another video I'll show you how to use this Search Console. It's really incredible. So I really suggest that you put it on to this, the Search Console straight away. So here I am on a Divi Engine test site, um, and it looks like this. Now, the principles work the same for all sites. You go to the Search Console web page, which at the moment looks like this. It could change depending on when you watch this video. Just type into Google the Search Console, and it will look like this. You then click Start Now, and what it does is that it's uh, links with your Gmail account so your Gmail needs to be open and yours won't look like this if you have no sites it'll be blank but up here you'll see a little arrow and if you click there and then you click add property it brings up a, a pop-up like this and it gives you two options I suggest you go with the URL prefix so what you want to do here is add your URL of your website in in here so I'm going to go to my Divi Engine test site and I'm going to add it in here. You then click continue. Now, the Google Search Console is going to give me two options for how um, I can basically tell Google Search Console that I own the website. So your first one is to download this file. and I'm not going to show you this way because it's a little bit longer, but you can do this if you want. You download it, click, then you take that file and you dump it into the public HTML folder of your website. If you don't know what the public HTML folder is, please get in touch with me, Dave at Divi Engine, and I will help you. So you download this and you literally dump it straight in there and then you click ver verify. The other way, which is slightly easier, is you click on this arrow where it says HTML tag. And can you see there's this white box over here? And it says meta name, Google site verification, and a bunch of numbers. Highlight that, copy it, go to your the, your, the WordPress end of your website. You'll all know what this looks like here. You scroll down until you see your Divi uh, logo. You click that, and then you click on this word which says integration. Now you can see there are three or four boxes here. This one here is uh, to add code into the head of your blog. If you don't know what that means, don't worry. But that's to add code into the head. This is to add code into the body of your website. So you click this. You just create some spaces. It doesn't matter how many you have. And you copy and paste it in there. But I normally like to have one space between the last code just for myself so I know what's going on. Then you will see this code in here. You scroll down and you click save. It is that easy. Once you see the Divi, the Divi arrow, um, I mean tick mark, you go back to the search console and you scroll down, you click verify. Google's gonna go look for that piece of code you've just put into your website. And there we go. Ownership verified and you click go to property and you're done. Fantastic. So that's how you add a website to Google Search Console. I suggest you go do that right now and you can watch another video in, in some time uh, where I show you how to use it. Thank you very much and I hope you have a fantastic day and please do get in touch with us if you need any help.